People here deliver hot meals to about 200 seniors in the area every single day, but today they made sure to deliver frozen meals as well, since they're going to be gone till early next week. With winter rolling into the metro, Ann Miller is on a mission. Our folks come to us in their time of need. To deliver meals to those who frequent the Don Bosco Senior Center in Kansas City. Just don't forget our elderly and disabled people that are going to need help in the next few days. Some of the seniors she helps don't have family in the area, and without someone checking in on them, the weather can prove to be deadly. We had no clue that he was suffering in his, he owned his own home, it was in serious disrepair. Years ago, an older man she worked with fell victim to the elements right in his own home. Never said a word. He was found after a cold spell, had frozen to death in his own home, and he had a good friend who had been checking on him. Even the friend did not know he was living without heat. She says many seniors are proud and don't like asking for help, even if it means living without heat. Jeanette? Anne is making her first delivery to Jeanette Foreman, a woman recently diagnosed with leukemia. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you. It's been a little while. Yeah, come on here. Come here. Please, please, please. It is absolutely so cold, you know. Jeanette's husband died a few years ago, and her kids live elsewhere. They're, they're just nice people. They're just wonderful people. Still, she's not too worried heading into tomorrow, knowing her daughter will regularly check in with her. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she'll probably call me. But she's living in Florida. She's thankful for Anne and the others with Don Bosco, knowing they're making sure she shouldn't have to leave home during the extreme cold. God sent them to me for some reason. As Anne heads to her final few deliveries, she hopes others take note by making sure older neighbors and relatives stay safe. The public needs to remember, hey, no matter what the weather is, try to take care of in advance or the minute you can get out, say, Saturday or Sunday, invite them over. And if you do lose power or just need a warm place to stay during these next few days, uh, we have a complete list of all the warming shelters around the KC Metro. You'll find that on our website, fox4kc.com.